in this tutorial we will place the remaining details such as we'll draw this plinth line that is which will be traced from here plinth line then we will place this hidden roof line which is in line with this and we will place these chajjas which are the part of the window so and we will place these steps so these details we will be placing in this tutorial so let's start with suppose p length line so it is 0.1 mm outside so we will create that so for p length we can create one more layer new layer p length then we will give some other color to it okay and make that layer current p length then we have to offset this line by 0.1 so we will say offset now here in offset setting layer is source that means when we offset the layer remains as the source layer so we don't want the source layer we want the layer current layer as a on our offset should be created on the current layer and not on the source layer so we will change that setting in layer and we will say it current click on the current so our and we will just change uh, color for this so we will check that where it is coming on that because the color is same for wall and pillin so we will not understand that so we will just take this layer the color okay then again offset now here layer is current so our offset will be created on the current layer so we will give distance of 0.1 and select wall line click outside so from all the sides we will create that just click and click outside so on this side okay it is gone like this so here also we will create one then press enter to come out then this corner can be connected using fillet command fillet so here right now radius setting is zero so it will not create arc and it will only connect the lines so fillet he is asking for the fillet again and again so we can make to run the fillet for as many time as we want just click on this multiple and so fillet will not close down and it will continue for as much time as we want so click on the all the lines so plinth line will be created so in this way this plinth line is created press enter to come out then next is suppose we will create this steps so we will take it as a 230 so for that also we will make one more layer that is steps take some color close it then we will create one line from this point to this intersection enter the, to change the layer of this line select this line and click on steps press escape to come out and make the steps layer current then offset this line by 0.23 select line offset downward so three steps has been created then connect the line from end to end enter now here p length is hidden if we see here the p length line has been shown in hidden line so for that we will cre create one more layer new layer that is p length 
dash h for Eden. Then we will choose that color for pill in theta. So we want the color 231 same as the pill length. So here line type we will change the line type from continuous. Click on this continuous. Then here hidden is not available. Just load. Click here and for hidden first character is H. So just click H. Press H on keyboard. So hidden is here. Okay. Select hidden. Okay. Then close it. Then change or now here this line are complete complete lines. So we want only from this point to this point. So we will break it. So for that you can use break at point. Click on break at point. Select the line. Give the point where you want to break. Again break at point. Select the line. Where, click where you want to break. Then select these two lines. Then from here select fill in edge. Press escape to come out. So in this way. And to reduce the gap between these hidden lines, give the LTS command. Line type scale, enter, and reduce the gap. Point it, enter. So we'll reduce it somewhat more. Press enter to repeat the command. Point six. Okay. Press escape to come out. So in this way, that P length line is created completely, and steps are also created. Then after the P length is there, steps are there. Then next is this top line, uh, roof line. So we will take it as 300 distance. So 0.3. Again, same process we will be doing. So we will offset it by 0.3 distance. Here, uh, actually, we seen that we offset here two times because these two there are two lines. So we can join this line by using join command here so it will create single line so select join select these two lines enter so a single line will be created so it will be easy to offset so we want to go for point 3 from wall distance so from here it will be point 2 so for that we will create one more layer so it was a new layer for roof and the line is hidden so we will give it h and give the color okay then give the line type as hidden okay close it then offset the outside line or we can also offset it in single stroke by joining the complete line so just joined the outside line so it will create a single polyline so it will be easy to offset so we'll just create Joined all of these lines and press enter. So this has created a single outside line. So it will be easy to offset. In single offset, it can be offsetted. So offset give the distance of point two. Now here already layer setting is current. So here we will make the layer roof edge. And select this outside line, click outside, enter. So, in this way, complete offset is created for roof. So, roof line here is it has been connected. So, we will connect that line there. So, we will just take line from here, or we can stretch it also. We will escape it, stretch. Select crossing window, so it should come inside the window. Enter, then give the base point at this line and second point at this line. So, in this way, this roof line is created properly. Then, roof is created. Then, next will be this chajas chajja for window. So, for that, also we will create one more layer. So, new layer. New layer chajja. Then give some color. Okay, close it. Now for chajja again, hidden line is there. So hidden has been already automatically set it because of this roof. Roof was current and chajja is created below it. 
therefore it has already taken the hidden line so no need to change it just close it now again make the chajja layer current take the line command now chajja will start at a distance of 100 from this point on this side so just track this point go upside and put the distance of 0.1 then make orthon you can press f8 on keyboard to make the orthon give the distance of 0.6 now here this window was of 1.5 length so it will be 1.7 so we will give 1.7 then again here we will track this endpoint and click here press enter to come out so in this way this chajja is created so same chajja will be here also so we'll just copy it copy these three lines enter give base point take it outside enter then we will rotate it so rotate select object enter give the base point make the line vertical and click then move it then again we will say move select object enter now we want the midpoint of this two point so we'll just we can also use shift right click mid between two points just click on these two points so it will automatically give the midpoint make the orthon press f8 on keyboard and place it, place it here so now midpoint he is showing here so just track this midpoint and come down and click there so in this way this chajja is created same way we can create here also so this is 2 meter length so we will take again line track the point go upside put the distance of 0.1 then make orthon f8 press f8 give the distance of 0.6 again here it will be 2.2 because window is 2 meter long and again connect here by tracking the point press enter now here it will be the mirror image of this so we will just mirror it mirror select object enter first point of mirror line or we can catch the midpoint here so it will automatically place there midpoint here give the second point enter so in this way this chajjas has been created all, all the four chajjas has been created then i think all the remaining details has been created one more thing this section line actually so we'll create this section line also so for that we will create one more layer new layer called section then give, choose the color okay then he, here we will need a pantham line because for section there are one big line and two small line one big line again two small line so that is pantham pantham line so select here click on this hidden click load for pantham p is the first letter so on keyboard press p then select ok pantham ok then close it make the section line current then create the section line so here from ventilator here and here so we will create a section line take the line track this midpoint from here it will come up to here from here it will go here and it will go down press escape to come out so in this way this section line is created then at the corner triangles has been placed so for that for creating those triangle you can use here click on arrow near rectangle click on polyline then give the number of sides as 3 enter then choose the edge method click here on edge give the first point give the second point then here is actually single color has been filled into it so from here you can choose hatch and click solid and click inside and close as creation so in this way 
this has been created so same triangle is required below also just copy it click on copy select the object enter give the following base point so we can place it at the end of other end then press enter so in this way the section line is also created so all the details has been created now in next, le next lecture we will see how to place the text so we'll stop here thank you